And new tonight, I spoke with the director of the CSI Refugee Center in Twin Falls, and I was surprised to learn he feels that there is some positive side to this whole issue. Um, the donation, people bring donations. I first met Zizi Rosama last fall when I toured the refugee center in Twin Falls. I learned that some 300 people come through this center each year as part of the UN Refugee Resettlement Program. They come from all over the world seeking a better life for their families. So print your name. At the center, they get help with learning English and finding jobs and a place to live. The President Trump has put a 120 day hold on the refugee program to allow time to investigate the safety of the vetting process. Talking by phone with Rosama, he told me some refugees here were expecting family members to join them this month. So it's sad uh, to see some, some of the refugees that are very happy uh, waiting for the family members to come, and then now they have to wait another four, another four months. But Rosama says there is a positive side to having a new administration redesign a program to their liking. Now they are not going to be blaming uh, someone else. It's their program, they own it, they'll design it to, to succeed. Rosama says it's good for everyone, including the refugees, if everybody feels safer about the process. If it takes for him to do that, to suspend the program 120 days, that is fine. After these four months, everyone will be satisfied and, and, and then refugees will feel uh, welcome even more uh, in our communities again. Rosama did tell me, though, that the current vetting program for refugees is very thorough, and he doubts the president will find many improvements that need to be made.